Welcome to this tutorial on the Roland FA06 using the synthesizer keyboard with Cubase. This will address the situation where Cubase is sending out multiple parts over many MIDI channels and the FA06 playing all parts instead of certain channels from Cubase. The best way I would approach this is set your FA06 to a specific MIDI channel. In this case we are going to go with MIDI channel 6. To do this go to the main menu, system, then enter, then across to the MIDI tab. Your MIDI channel, in this case is 6. Make sure the remote keyboard is off and the USB MIDI through is off and return to the main menu. Now you should have returned to the studio set. Studio set is similar to Korg's combination mode. Roland have decided to split the studio set into two other areas. The first one is the door panel. This is where you make your MIDI channel receive settings and the other is sequencer settings and this is where you make your level settings including a mix of it using the shift and mixer button. This can be quite confusing for people visiting Roland and being used to the Korg setup. Go to door settings and tap across and change the MIDI channels to 6 matching your keyboard's default settings which you have done earlier. This will enable you to play the combi sounds as you hear in the FA06. So in this case I have selected a couple of sounds to the same channel so that I can get layered sounds all on MIDI 6. And the channels you do not need simply switch them off or change to a different MIDI channel if required. Now exit from the door control and then move over to the sequence of controls. And remember, this is all in the same studio set or combi set. Here you can adjust the level and view the mixer as described earlier using the shift and mixer button. Once you have completed this, you can return to the studio setup and you are ready to go. The trick is, in the system menu, make sure the remote keyboard is off and the USB MIDI through is off and the FA06 will not try and play all your Cubase MIDI channels from your song. Hope this helps and please subscribe and leave any comments below. Thanks for watching.